three parts to our bracket today. So uh, Te Kotahi Tanga is one, uh, Te Tiriti o Waitangi is the other one, and of course Te Okofutu R2. And that's who we are, uh, Te Okofutu R2. In 1931, uh, Nani Tweening Awai, this was a big uh, inspiration for her, uh, Wai Parapara, and still is. And so we, we carry on um, those things, those traditions that uh, well, we try as best as we can and hold on to uh, the messages and the kaupapa within her waiata. And of course, the war songs became very popular in her time in the second, during the Second World War. The, the second part of it, of course, her whakapuno within the Ringa Two Faith, which comes out um, in, um, in the waiata, in the, in the compositions. And of course, a big part of that uh, whakapuno at the time was also the messaging through the Tiriti Waitang, right back in the 1840 when the treaty was around the Motu getting um, signed. A lot of our people saw the things that uh, you know, our treaty partner weren't doing. You know, they wrote things down uh, but didn't necessarily abide by them. And so she used a lot of that and of course her own personal influence through Su Apidanangata um, and people like that who supported her because she was the person that gelled the, you know, that gelled the whanau here and right across, right through Ta Te Tairawhiti. She jailed them because of you know the, the, the way it is she uh, and the person she uh, she was and the way it is that she wrote and that composed. You know, there's some strong messages in there about the treaty and not being abided to, not being adhered to, and you know. So we're just going to keep on singing them because they're still relevant. Everybody had a part. Even if you if you couldn't do the haka properly, you couldn't. She'll make you carry the guitar. You know, she had never discouraged anybody from coming and doing the haka or being a part of that fano. She didn't like fakataitai. Well, look what it's done to our yeah. to our to so our um, tikanga, to our you haka, and that we all competing and you know, it's fafai, oh well I'm gonna be in the front, that in the front, you know, with the T V cameras, all of that. They're lined, the stick? they're lined up now, now. Well pretend you're doing a haka and she'd be walking down the, the rows. And then see you you suppose you you know haka with your like that, eh? You don't you don't do that or that or what. Mm. And she'd walk down and she'd see somebody doing the wrong thing. She just walked down there. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Or she'd go and just, you know, bring you in the chest and get to the back. You know, that sort of thing. <laughs> but well, there was Nanny.
It must have been really important because Nanny Tweeny wrote uh, a lot of songs around Matariki and that was our introduction as to what Matariki was. Because uh, up to that point we didn't know anything about Matariki and it has a lot to do with the, the Kotahi Tanga movement as well. So they, they go together. So and so, I know how pretty hooky rato, Yarato, I know. Engani, you know, called it a stick of more mato. We didn't know anything about Matariki. But yeah, 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 we didn't know. We only know Matariki in the song. <laughs>
even today when the groups come back for Matatini, everybody's got to come from the, from the outside. But Pini te manu, eh? Ka tau, ka tiko, ka rere. Yeah, ka mahua te hau kainga. So that's the, the, that's the concept that we have now today. And that's happening all the time with our meetings, with the land, you name it. They come in and then they go out. You know, ka mahua te hau kainga. So now we're going to try and come back to the hau kainga. We hold the ao ki waho, you know. I mean, they took we era, era, and at the crow at the era quarter, they put out to go to ki waho, and I came here to our park here. We're not in touch with our with our, our younger generations, and they're not in touch with us. But that can't be helped because that was the desire. But the other side, we we lost our real meal tata tikanga, you know, kaputata ki waho, and so it left a huge gap. You know, the Second World War left a huge gap, and we're still feeling it today because we don't have 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 our cream de la cream in Ngāti Pro, mate mate katoa And so consequently, you get the woman coming up to do the do. The do. Uh, and so we're in that space now where, you know, ke kuhuri te ao, ke te whakārana, me tū ngā wāhi ne ki runga ki te kore, era tū mo mo āhuatanga. But ko oti ke ena, ena, ena kaupapa. We just have to move on and try and hold on to what we've got. E mānga tamariki mānga mokopuna ko ina e whai Tikanga, Kerotona, Aitera, Taku Mauritanga, ah, and going the Kare Kore, Kahuki Maiti, the Kanga, Ine on Takahanga, a way way, a quena, a quena Taku Tumano, eh, Yamoto, Pupu. Matewa e Tidro Tidonga, Mehe, Matewa e Faka. Yeah,